Hello, hello. How are people doing tonight? Starting a tiny bit earlier than usual, just because uh, I'm gonna end stream a little bit before nine. So we are on a little bit of a, a little time crunch, but it's usually when we end stream anyway, so it's no big deal. Um, disclaimer warning as always, because Hellblade is a rough game for some people, so I'm just gonna, until I finish this game, I'm probably just gonna do this every time we start stream, just in case any new people pop in, or anyone who um, isn't aware of the, the warning in the game. I'll just keep, I'll just keep doing this every time we start Hellblade, um, until I finish it. Yeah. Well, I hope everyone's having a good week. My week's been pretty wild, to be honest. Like, it's... <laughs> it's definitely been a lot. My school job has been scheduling me like crazy, even though we can't afford to be scheduling people as often as we are. Um, school's been alright. My art class is probably my favorite. And then games and culture, the class I'm taking that made me get this game is <laughs> also really fun because I just play video games. Like, right, this this stream is technically part of one of my assignments, so it's pretty cool. Live, live, live. Tyler, how are you doing tonight? We're just chilling, waiting for people to pop in while we leave the disclaimer warning up. Tyler, how has school been since school started for you? You've been chilling. How many times did you die in your last playthrough? Uh, I think three. Three or three, I think. Need to see what to camp a point, son. Gotcha, gotcha. I really hope I don't die this this stream. I feel like if I do get a game over, it'll be next stream. But I don't know how how much more difficult it's gonna amp up now that we fought the first boss. I don't know how much harder it's gonna get. Like how quickly it's gonna get harder and then I'll get the game over. You can as a mod, that's busted. You can just pretend you did, because can't you like give and take boy channel points to yourself? I'm glad classes are going well. Do you have any favorites? Because you're doing a lot of science classes, right? Tuesdays and Wednesdays are long as days, but we persevere. I'm taking a marine mammals class, which is cool. Ooh! That's really interesting. You're going on a whale watch on Saturday? That's awesome. I'm going to an arcade tomorrow. That's my field trip. So that's pretty cool. Boston Harbor. You definitely take pictures if you find any whales. Your classes are so cool. Like I know they're really science based and I'm not a STEM person. My brain is my brain has forgot science and math years ago. But I I think that's so cool. You're so smart. <laughs> You're taking genetics too. Damn. Tyler, what's your major again? Is it environmental science? Or is it like a more niche type of science? General bio, no concentration yet? Ooh. Are you leaning towards a concentration? Or are you just gonna kinda wing it until you get to senior year? Leaning towards environment eco? I, if I was going, into, if I was doing a biology, I would also concentrate in eco, in ecology. I'm actually taking the intro class for it right now. Um, 
I didn't realize ecology and earth science were the same thing. At least earth science as high school level. Or environmental, not earth science. Because earth science is like the soil and stuff. I like it so far. My first test on it is tomorrow. Wish me luck. <laughs> it's on canvas, so I'm not super stressed about it. He just has it set up in a way that you can't go back. Like, he has one question displayed at a time, and if you go to the next question, you can't go back to the previous question. So I have to really make sure I'm happy with my answer before I move on, which kind of sucks. It is seven, seven o'clock. What course are you taking? I'm taking um, basically like the intro level course. I'm taking um, ecological system interactions or something like that. It's basically like purely focusing on like stuff like food webs and like how external factors change the environment and change those networks that exist in those habitats. Yeah. I, I already am really interested in that type of part of ecology, so like this whole class is just focusing on that. But like, this first test co covers mainly like the vocab, being like, what's a population? What's a species? Like all stuff I remember from AP Earth Science or AP Environmental Science. So like, I'm not super stressed. But he's also a professor that's like, the book's not going to teach you anything. The tests are going to be on my lectures, and you have to be able to really understand the depth behind just memorization and I'm like dude I have no I have no idea what these questions are gonna be like I've never had this professor before your lab final was a food web that took you four hours Ooh. could never my finals have always been either tests that are no more than a couple hours projects or papers never labs I hate labs I hate them so much. I've never liked labs because if I want to learn hands-on, I want it to be more like a mentorship type thing, not a lab. Because I don't like labs. I think they're really boring and tedious. At least all the labs I did. Because my first experience with labs was bio, and that wasn't bad, but it wasn't the best. And then in chemistry, I just hated it because I didn't understand anything that was going on because I didn't understand chemistry. Yeah, bio labs over can labs any day. Alright, I'm gonna get rid of this little image. I'm going to actually <laughs> look back over at the controls so I can remember how to play the game. <laughs> um, sense is kind of high, low key. Strafing, interacts F. Focus is R. I forgot we rebound that. Shift, so R is focus. F, shift, space, block, change. What's E? Oh, E is to change. You look while do discussion board posts? Have fun doing discussion board posts. Alright. That's not possible, but thanks. I hate discussion board posts, man. Because you're just like, you're just trying to fill in the words so that you can say you added something substantial. And half the time, it's people just pulling random quotes and being like, I, I think that, I think this is really important, quote, because XYZ, even though it has nothing to do with the reading. Like, their reason for it being important has nothing to do with the topic. It's really funny, actually. Oh, wow, so dark. Turn up my screen brightness. Is it too dark for you guys? I forgot I turned my brightness down. Where are we? Oh, it like put us over here. Because we ended over here by Helheim. By the gate to it. Yeah, so our infection has spread almost to our elbow. It's getting up there. Are we ready? Alright. Got a fire, let's go. 
What's gonna happen? Senua. You good? Sort. The fire giant has answered. Oh. He comes from a land older than mankind. And the Northmen call upon his flaming sword to raise their enemies to the ground. Find him, Senua. Just spill his blood. Uh <laughs> Druth really doesn't like this guy. She found the wretched old fool on her way back from the wilds. An outcast. Was badly burnt all over. Oh. She took pity on him. That's why he doesn't like her. He was not long for this world. So pretty. Like her. Who spoke of his own darkness. The Northmen. Look at that bridge. Oh, there's a face behind the waterfall. That's not creepy at all. Hello, waterfall face. How are you? Able to focus on it? Can I go this way? Senua. We each walk these lands, gazing towards different horizons. Some of us further than others. Is her mother? Your father cannot see yeah. what you see. But there is nothing wrong with seeing the world the way you do. Okay. Thanks, Mom. Oh, this game is so pretty. It's so gorgeous. Also, let me know if it's too dark for you guys. I had to turn up my monitor brightness because I had it really low earlier. But if it's too dark and you can't see anything, let me know. Uh, is it the darkness? are stronger. Oh fuck. Don't give up. No, I'm dodging. What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Please. I'm trying to dodge. Oh. I'm so glad that like health doesn't not reset after combat. This game is so pretty. Rechanging the binds to switch targets has been so helpful. I don't really like the default binds being below W.
Am I supposed to find like the symbols? Oh, I can go over here. I don't know where the runes are. I don't hear the runes. The runes are at water? This is harder than the Val Raven one. It's this one, right? Wasn't it? Wait. It's right here, but it won't. It's right over here somewhere, I just can't see it. What does it look like? I thought it had to look like the Y thing. Like, I swear it's this thing. slid over it on accident. Are they screaming? Well, where are the rooms? I don't see any. Am I supposed to like get up there somehow? It's right here somewhere. Oh, the runes are important. I heard the runes are in water. Is there Do I have to like line it up just right? I don't see it. I hear the screams, but I can't figure out 
how am I supposed to line this up? There's like nothing that is like indicating, hey. There's nothing saying, hey, I'm over here. Because the H one, the first one didn't really, wasn't clear either. I just happened to accidentally look at it. So like, I don't even know what I'm supposed to be looking for. I don't see the runes. Am I able to go around? Maybe I have to go like back the way I came? can't go that way. Oh wait! There's a cave there. Cause that's where I came in from. So I can go this way. The Northmen tell this story. Oh, we're missing Before two. Before the Earth was created. There was a world called Muspels. Because it was in the south, it was bright and hot, flaming, burning. Sparks that flew out from Muspel became the stars. Other sparks melted ice in the frozen world of Niflheim, creating the body of the first giant, Ymir. Muspel is one of the nine worlds, and is now the land of the fire giants. And people from elsewhere cannot endure a journey there. Mm. Okay, so that was just a rune. So it has to be... It has to be what you were looking at. I just don't know where the rune is. I don't know why that locked in on that. Hello? Like, it's so clearly right here. Oh wait, did I just do it? So it is this thing. Why does not have it lined up right? I'm assuming that if it's in the middle of the screen, that means that I was close, right? Bro. <laughs> I don't know where it is! 
Wait, what does the H one look like? It was like over here. This is gonna take a while. So, was it because that formed an H? So then this has to be the guy on the cross thing, right? Because if- hang on, let me look at the door again. Okay, yeah. It was because it formed the shape using the poles. So you're not counting it? It's right there! I know the runes are important, but I don't see it. Is there like a Y hidden here somewhere? Cause this one's like the obvious answer, right? But it's not fitting. Hello? Like I don't know what else could be a Y shape with the thing in the top, except this guy. Like, hello? Oh, is that it right there? Wait, it has the blue on it. Oh my god, this is actually frustrating. Where- where is this supposed to be? Like, it's so clearly this. But it's just not letting me. But if it's supposed to line up perfectly, it's never going to. Unless you, like, got lower. But it won't let me get lower. actually pissing me off now. It's this thing! You guys can hear- like, if I look here, I'm looking here. Not working. But if it's on this thing, it's super loud. But if I look down, it's not it. It gets this thing. I don't know why it's not- Oh, uh, wait. Bro. Why? Why? Is this going to be harder than Val Ravens? I can already feel it. Look towards the gate, and you will see that it has opened. Back with Wingstop. <laughs> you didn't miss much. I I ended up staring at a dude on a cross for like 20 minutes, it felt like. I think it was about 20 minutes, actually. Because... When first came to my land, I knew enough of their tongue to beg for mercy, and they took me as a slave. I wish now that they had slaughtered me like the others. That cross right over there... I was looking at it forever, and I was like, why won't it work? Because you have to focus on it. Oh, whoa. I know it well. And I'm still here to fight it. Whoa. Um. Hello? Sir, sir, sir. That's unpleasant. 
Am I about to fight people again? Oh, this looks cool. Wait, that's so pretty. Hang on. Gotta do... Wait, where's camera mode again? Photo mode is the home button. I want to take a picture of this. Hang on. Oh, wait. Um, visibility. Turn Senua off. And then home. Ah, oh, that's so pretty. Okay, we're back. Sorry, I just had to take a picture of that. That was just really pretty. Oh, this area is cool. So that's his lair. I think I'm gonna have to fight some people soon. Yep. Oh shit. I'm trying to... Do you see how late that parry was? Oh my god. Bro, I die here. The fuck? I'm trying! Oh shit. Go. Get up! Oh my god. He's down. I hello do you see how late that block was? What the fuck? Is this the only guy? It's not the only guy, what the fuck? <laughs> Fucking hell, man. These guys are so difficult. The guy with the shield is so hard. There's that guy. I have to find fire. Well, how convenient that this is right here. Okay, but I need to hit them. I need to melee them. Oh, those are bodies. Whoa. Run for your life! 
Whoa. Um. Oh, whoops. What did I just do? Oh, well. <laughs> Wait. How do I? Uh oh. Hello? Escape. Yes. Oh, it's truth! But you mustn't look away from the horrors it does offer. Because you cannot overcome suffering if you refuse to look at it. Oh, is it darkness again? That little glowing thing on the floor. Maybe it was a test. Oh. Cert. Cert is through there. He's waiting. You can't get through. How will she get through? She'll need to find another way. Truth. Cert. Find your own door. There's always another way. There's always a way. Find your own way. You just have to find it. He's waiting for you. It was never going to be that easy. He's waiting. Cert is waiting for you through now. The Northmen say that the defender of Muspel is called Cert, the foremost of the fire giants. His name means the Black One, because he is like something burnt. The Northmen believe that he sits at the border of Muspel with his flaming sword, and at the end of the world he will leave his post. He will travel to Asgard and Midgard, waging war against all the gods. He will be victorious. And then burn the whole world with fire. Damn. I love all the Norse lore we're getting. I think it's super cool. Oh, it's another one of those doors. Another gate. Another gate. She needs to find it. Another fire sacrifice. Another fire sacrifice. Find the fire cinema. To follow the path to Surt. To Surt. Oh, fuck. I don't want to fight people right now. It's too far. She'll never find it. She'll never make her way back. She needs to remember the way back. What happens when she finds it? Everything will burn. Concentrate. Concentrate on where you're going. She needs to remember the path. Everything will burn. Then how will she find the way back? <laughs> she won't. Oh, because all of these plants are going to catch on fire. Okay. So straight, and then Is that it right there. So straight, then left. Wait, nope, that's a dead end. So straight, right. Wait, that's a dead end. Wait, what'll count as a path? Because these are dead ends right here. How much is this going to change? As I said, remember the path. Hi, Susu! How are you doing tonight? The Northmen believe that the world will be destroyed someday. They call it Ragnarok, the destiny of the gods. Asgard will be attacked by Surt and the fire giants. A monstrous wolf will swallow the sun and the gods will fight in vain against their enemies. There is nothing they can do to prevent it, but Odin ever seeks knowledge and magic, hoping, hoping to find a way to postpone that dark day. I'm glad you're doing so good. I'm doing pretty good too. A little, like, little overworked at school slash on campus job but other than that doing pretty good what do you mean find the path like remember the path i can't even find the path oh is it right here well as i say it so you come out and then go right yeah yeah, yeah. wait this is a long path 
The Northmen made fire sacrifices, burning slaves like me to reveal the path to search. Not the darkness. I searched for meaning in their suffering, in their eyes. But they just screamed like helpless pigs. God, this is a long path back. Is there a shortcut? I want to see if there's a shortcut before I look at that. Okay, I think I can take this. Yeah, so I take this, I think, and then hop down. Yeah, I can. Okay. Sorry, we're going back up. I just wanted to make sure I could hop down. Because, seriously, when I touch that rock, <laughs> everything's going to catch on fire, and I'm going to have to try and get to the gate before I die. <laughs> so I was trying to find a shortcut instead of going all the way around like this. So we can take that drop down, and then just go straight, and it'll take us back to the door. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, Senua. It's right there. Oh. oh my god. Do your gods answer My truth scares me. I asked the gods for mercy, all of them, even theirs. None answered. In the end, I set myself free. Defy the gods, Senua. Find your own path, like I find mine. My gods abandoned me. I am alone. Wait, that actually did fall then. Maybe these aren't illusions. Anyway, maybe you're actually getting caught on fire. She's things to think about. Oh, I see. You will be the epitome. <laughs> yeah, exactly. The this is fine. <laughs> another door. Oh, we just did one. I have to do another one. Come on, sir. Whoa, this is like destroyed houses. The Northmen say that at Ragnarok, the sons of Muspel will travel to battle in the ship called Nagalfar, the corpse ship. And when the sons of Muspel leave the ship and ride to battle, it will be as though the sky had split open, and Surt will lead them. Wherever he goes, flame will erupt before him, and fires will burn behind him. I appreciate Druth giving us all of this lore. Oh, I don't want to fight in here. Wait, is that a rune? It is a rune. Wait a minute. Why do I have two doors? The Northmen of Hell worship the Devourers, insatiable gods of darkness. I come from Aaron. Oh my god, that plant scared me. I, I thought it was a giant spider. I was a man of knowledge, not a warrior. To survive, I did things. Bad things. Like you, Sinua. The man I once was has died. And when that happens, even gods you worship can die with you.
Let's go. We found one. Alright, and the next one is this X thing. I don't know if we already passed that or not. Oh, fuck. I mean, whenever the darkness lights come on, I get really paranoid. I don't like the- <laughs> I don't like the fighting! It makes me so nervous that I'm gonna die. I don't know... Where's the screams? I need the screams to point me in the right direction. But it has to be outside. It's me. I've been wondering that it's every day. So far, but I don't cheat. Hello, where is this? Hello, <laughs> game. Where's the screams that are supposed to tell me where this is? I don't hear anything. We already read that one. Did he come from that way? Or does this one just not? It said no, no scream hints for you. This one's definitely harder than the last one. I'm glad we did Valraven first. Is it... Oh my god, that thing is freaking out. <laughs> I have no idea what the game is, what's going on. But I'll hope you're having a fun. I am, these puzzles are just really hard and I am not smart enough to do these. Like... They- this game has really good puzzles. At least for my skills type. <laughs> I can't do these puzzles. You have to find this shape, but it uses objects in the environment to do it. So it's not like it's like a symbol you find. It's like, see that? Was the R? But that's like the closest you would ever get to an actual symbol. Like, it's just random stuff that you just have to like- if the trees lined up a certain way, it would be it. Like, this game is really tricky. I swear half this game is just me walking around trying to solve a puzzle. I hope it's fun for you guys. <laughs> like, I enjoy it. I just hope it's fun for you guys to watch. <laughs> Good luck in Splitgate, by the way. Yeah, they're just not doing the little scream hints. And I'm pretty sure I have to open this gate to get to the the pyre for the other door. This is gonna be a twiki one. You guys see it? I have no idea. Look, these are such sharp angles, I feel like they would have to be in the house somewhere.
But it doesn't even look like you can try and find them in here. So it's, it's like a... It's like that, but... like up here somewhere? I have no... Hi, Cory! Um... We're stuck at puzzles. <laughs> These puzzles are hard. <laughs> they're all, They're like... They're like the Val Raven one where it had a whole bunch of the ravens and you had to like weed out the duplicates, except it's just the environment and you can't weed out the duplicates. Like that R-shaped fire symbol on the ground was one of the runes I needed, and then the one that's right here, the like crisscross hourglass thing, is um, the other one. So I have to find something in the environment that fits this shape and then focus on it from the right angle to get the rune. Like it is way harder. Yeah, no certify yet. I honestly don't know if we'll get to it tonight, to be honest. Just because, uh, I'm gonna end stream at 9, because I forgot today's Wednesday, so Love Island's tonight. So. Yeah. Do you fight the boss with puzzles? No. You fight the boss with combat, like, melee combat. I also almost died earlier, Cory. You can ask Tyler. But we survived, barely. Barely. <laughs> I have no idea where this thing is. They're supposed to give you like screaming hints, but there's no screaming hints. Oh wait, what's this? Oh wait, this is the way I came. Yeah, this is the way I came. Never mind. I came from this way. Same enemies or different ones? Um some are Val Ravens, but I'm starting to get more and more um, of the new ones. Like now they have shields. So, in order to be able to do damage, I have to melee them, like kick their shield to disarm them. But they're also throwing like two or three at me at the same time. So, it's getting more difficult. <laughs> I'm just waiting for the time where um, they start shooting projectiles. That's going to be fun. I have no idea where this thing is. I just got lucky with that one. Because I would just happen to be going across. And then it was like, oh, here's this one. Now find the other one. I also love the lighting in this game. This game's really pretty. I'm just really bad at the puzzles. And like, the combat. <laughs> I'm just really bad at the game. But I really like this game. <laughs> I don't know what fits this symbol. Like, see that R? That's one symbol that we did for the door. But, like, this symbol, I don't know what goes with it. Or, like, where I need to even be standing to look. Hey, I have no idea. That's one. And then I'd say I hop down. I'm trying to like do like level design thought. Like, okay, they find one, they hop down. I'm giving all the ones I need to find at once. So like, I could technically find them in any order. So I found this R, which is the flames on the ground right here that's pulsing. This is an R that matches if you're up there. So I'm trying to find something that's the site of the sideways hourglass. I don't know why it won't let me show you it. It's this door. Right here. It's that shape. We found the R. We need to find the sideways hourglass one. 
You're right, I never will find them. You guys are right. The voices are correct. This one is definitely more difficult than Val Ravens. And I can't tell, like, I almost wonder, would we have had a choice anyway? Because this just feels more difficult than Val Ravens. Unless the difficulty amps up. Like, I wonder if, like, it doesn't matter which order you pick. It'll just, like, always be that way. And in the first area with these runes, it had, like, a proximity sound system. So, like, you would hear screams the closer you got to it. And then that would give you an idea of where it is, but these ones don't, for some reason. Even though this mechanic was introduced with the sound cues. To give you, like, a proximity hint. Like, hey, they're kind of in this location. But this one just doesn't have it at all. So, like, I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm doing. Is this tree? Oh, I think you're right. Maybe it could be these. I just like... I angle it just right. <laughs> Your finger just like slid across the keyboard. What was that? I think you're right, maybe I have to go from this side. See, this is why I'm bad at this game. Cause like, you guys pop in and within five minutes you guys are like, Oh, what about that thing? And I'm like, oh, I've been walking around for the past 20 minutes and didn't even notice. <laughs> I'm, I'm so good. They do. I mean, I also like... It has to be this forest, because when I walk towards the forest, the runes show up. So I think you're right. I think it is these trees. Oh. Wait, was that just it? It just, like, popped up in the middle. Hello? It's gotta be it, right? Are you fucking kidding me? That was it? Oh my god. This this was that? Did You're telling me that this like this is what I mean. These puzzles are so hard. It's this. This was it the whole time. Oh my god. I hate this level. John Kane, I've never seen such a yeah, just one tree too far to the left. That's why I hate it. Oh, this is where this is. Okay. Alright, I know where I'm going. It was like right there. We got this. Let's do this. Also, this is like a time trial, Cory. If you don't get out in time, you die. <laughs> so. Let's go. Oh, is she on fire? Oh my god, Senua. I'm trying. You guys keep doing the little cutscene. What are you doing? Senua, what the fuck? Why are you going slow on this? Oh my god, Senua. You're so slow. Why? No! No! It was right there! Oh my god, are you fucking kidding me? I need out. I want out. I took too long. Oh fuck. 
I have to fight you guys? Are you serious? Go, 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 You hurry up! Oh my gosh, she took forever! Bro! Good. She keeps fucking taking forever. Raise your world! My world is dead! Only then. Also, Druth has some beef with Cert. So, just throwing that out there. I see nothing now. I assumed that you died. You are a voice in Senua's head. I am. <laughs> like, girl, you're coming so slow and fair what? <laughs> oh. I love the level design. Look at this. This is so cool. And like they didn't need to add this, but they did. Looking like my Valheim <laughs> Oh boy. I think it's funny that like his stuff has uh, the little outlook posts. It makes me think of Firewatch. Oh, here's another door. Alright, so this one has three runes. <laughs> Guess what guys, we're gonna be here for 30 minutes. <laughs> Alright. I can't even see them all on my screen Tell at once. Truth. How did you escape your darkness? Senua, once I found my purpose, he... I was no longer enslaved Wait. to the suffering I had to endure to reach it. Bro, why is this level so hard? By fear. Like unnecessarily I could difficult. See them clearly in others. P even my captors. Blind triangle. I don't even know what the one on the left is. It's like a Crooked T. I took my chance and ran, knowing that they would not follow. Can I go in here? The fool ran into the fire. <laughs> nope. Okay, I have to go the other they way. Left me for dead. Maybe they were right to. But here I am, free. So I'm just I'm glad I found you in the wilds. I wouldn't have made it without you. Yeah, so Druth was a slave, or like, he was- so he's a scholar. He was a scholar, and he was captured by the Norsemen, and he negotiated his slavery instead of death, which he later regrets because they treated him so badly. Um, and then he was like, burned and like, left in the woods to die, and then he found Senua, and that's how they met. And the rest is history. Oh. Northmen say that what we see as a rainbow is the bridge that goes from the world of men like to a meat cute <laughs> for now they say the frost giants and the mountain giants cannot cross it but they say that when Ragnarok comes not a thing in this world will be safe the rainbow bridge will break under the onslaught of the fire giants riding on flaming steeds Senua I have seen the fire of Surt spread far and wide, and to our lands. Ragnarok is coming. Hello? Are there any, like, goodies in here I can use? The areas are so big for these puzzles, too. Oh wait, the tea thing's glowing. Does that mean the tea thing's nearby? Alright, crooked tea, crooked tea. Where's crooked tea? Tea. Tea? Crooked tea? Hello? Just kind of like blindly moving my mouse around. <laughs> Be like, maybe it'll latch onto it for me and I don't have to actually think. 
over here. Oh, it's in the house. Is it in the? Oh wait, it's right there. It's it's right here. I found it. It's the get out of my way bucket. It's right here. This one. I found it. Ha ha. Yeah 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 yeah. It's this one. Yeah. It's this one. Oh, do I have to do it from the inside? Do I have to do it from the inside? Alright, well we found the T. Learning, we're learning. So it's... Wait, it's not this. We have to go from the other side. The fuck? Are you fucking kidding me? I literally just had to move two feet to the right. Bro. Alright, now I have to find the floating other symbols to figure out where they are instead of- Oh wait, I can open this door now. I don't understand- Okay. This is me being a nitpicky gamer, but... From a design standpoint, when you're introducing a new mechanic and you're, like, emphasizing the whole first puzzle of being like, hey, you can hear the screams and that'll tell you the proximity of where things are and then you just silently change it from screens to symbols floating in the sky like that doesn't make sense oh is that not the p am i seeing letters that aren't there like you're confusing it makes it more confusing than if you just like kept it the same from the start like, these last two puzzles haven't used proximity sound, but the first puzzle at the very beginning of the level that introduces you to certain runes and, like, how you find them used sound proximity. So it's weird that they now don't do it. But it never said they wouldn't do them anymore. Do you know what I mean? Like, I think that's just making it unnecessarily difficult for the player. What are your guesses on the why? Oh, wait. Did we come from this way? Can I climb this? Oh, let's go. We're going on the lookout tower. Oh, the 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 line things up here somewhere. According to this. The the one on the right, the line thing. here somewhere? I feel like the TikTok audio of Miley Cyrus singing What Does It Mean Right Now? That's my homework. That's my mean that I'm gonna submit to Waylon. Be like, hey, <laughs> the search level is terrible and I hate it. I can't find the puzzles. Is there anything could be the answer? Anything that in I that I can see can be an answer if I just stand in the correct square. Like it says that the symbols up here somewhere. Or like I can see it from here. It's supposed to be a vertical line with a triangle off the side of it. Vertical line triangle. The triangle. I feel like it's that, but maybe it's not that. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm repeating myself. I'm just oh, oh, wait, is it that? Is it? Is it this? Is it the flag? That's got to be it, right? Got to be this. 
I mean, I'm connecting a line that's not there. Hang on. Um, my brain is finishing the shape. It's not actually a line there. Uh... Narratively, visual hallucinations are a more extreme form of auditory. Moving to visual equals deeper connection. Gameplay-wise, it could be that they have a time set up where before a set time it's audio or visual, and then it flips after that time has passed. This game makes you feel like you're going insane. Yeah, but like... I don't know, I feel like it would, it would also make more sense if you also like saw the first puzzle, because when it's introduced, it's like, okay, I can go up here, which means that like, it has to be up here somewhere. The fuck? Where are you? Is it this? Not this. The... Triangle. I like the wind chimes. It, I, I agree. I think it's poorly communicated. Oh! It just latched. I don't know what it latched onto, but it, it's latched onto something. It's over here somewhere. Is it latching there? Can I fall off? I cannot. Okay. Hello? <laughs> Why can it latch there? What am I missing? Oh wait, was it this? Oh. Just went away. Is it like on this side? The auditory ones were more clear. Yeah, I'm trying to use, like, the game's registering the runes mechanic to try and figure out if I'm looking at the right object. Because <laughs> it'll stick in the center if you're close. See how, like, it's sticking in the center now? Whereas before it was on the right because you start with three symbols. So it means that I'm close to it. I just gotta find it. Is it the door? Is it the fire? Is it the mountains? Puzzles be different. I feel like that kind of fits. It's just missing like the last little thingy. Missing the little bottom part of the triangle. Wait, that's weird. Why did it change the camera like that? Look <laughs> at the camera, just like, whoop! What? Oh, I'm inside Senua. Hey. Um. I don't know. My brain is sizzling. I have the TikTok audio stuck in my head now. <laughs> oh my god. One of the girls like, What does it mean? What does it mean? What does it mean? I don't know where this is. Can't, why can't I just burn the door down? It's all wood anyway. I'm trying to like... Is it here somewhere? It's a vertical line, so I need to find a vertical line. Vertical base. I 
It's gotta be something, like, one of these has to be over here somewhere. Like, I... Why is this sticking to the middle? Do not tell me it's like the railing mixed with the fence post. So it's definitely over here somewhere, or at least like on this part of the walk I should be able to see it. Like on this part of the little balcony thing. But I don't know where it could be. Watch well, it be like something far off in the distance. Be like, oh that kind of looks like it. I wonder if this like rune puzzle is based off the lore, based off Norseman mythology. Because, like, the runes wouldn't be explicitly carved, they would be symbols you would find by chance, mostly. Right? So maybe that's what this is about? Maybe that's why these puzzles are like this? Or maybe they're just trying to, like, keep the theme kind of the same. Do yeah, what this fits for. <laughs> this is so difficult. Uh, anyone see a vertical line P? It almost makes a P. Like, when I get to this part, it turns into this shape. When I get to this part on the bridge, like, I go back, it switches. The minute I go here, it switches to this shape. So I gotta be near it, right? Because of the way it's changing? Uh. So ah. Oh, is it that? Could go next for a bit and come back up. Yeah, we can try that. Maybe I have to do the other one first, and then I'll be able to find this one. Oh my god, I'll be so upset. <laughs> Cause it's always like, once I see it, I'm like, really? Really? Watch it be like, you weren't supposed to be on it, you're supposed to be under it to see it. Be like, what's the point of walking up if it doesn't count? Alright, so let's find P. Where's the letter P? This feels like we're looking for the alphabet. Maybe it's back this way. Do, 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 do. It's down here. Oh no, this is the room. This doesn't count. Okay. Look for floating letters, children. Oh! Okay, Mr. P is in here somewhere. Mr. P, Mr. P, you're right here. Let's go. PCP is so easy. So we got that one. Alright, now <laughs> we took a short break and we're already back to having to go to the other one. I feel like that one's easy and the other one was easy because they're similar to English characters. So they just look like normal alphabet letters but like in a weird font. Whereas this is just a weird geometric shape so like I don't... 
I don't draw the connection at all. Yeah, I love this environment. Cert's place is pretty cool, not gonna lie. These puzzles are brutal, but like... Is it like some weird shape from down here? Vertical line with a triangle. Hello? Shit? I would like to enter your abode. Wait, what the fuck? Why did that like flash blue? Was it saying, hey dumbass, it's over here somewhere? It like flashed blue, did you see that? Does that mean it's like over here in this pile of bodies or something? Hello? Don't mind me, rotten corpses. I'm trying to find the letter P. It's gotta be this thing. Why else would I be allowed to climb up this? Like, I shouldn't be allowed to climb up this if it's not part of the puzzle. Right? Like, it's gotta be up here somewhere. like over here somewhere one of these weird little sticks stick buddies stick stick buddy also Cory I'm gonna bring up my microwave popcorn that I still haven't used since we don't have a microwave <laughs> I'm gonna bring that up this weekend so we can use it before you leave air air Hey. Hey. This one sucks. The other ones were so easy compared to this one. I feel like I'm just missing it. I feel like it's staring me in the face. I'm excited for us to finish the Castlevania series. Everyone, if you guys haven't seen Castlevania on Netflix, you should watch it. It's a good show. It's about vampires and vampire hunters and Dracula. Very, it's very good. 10 out of 10 would recommend. Is it this? I think so. Senua got it tattooed on her forehead. She won't show me. She said no. Nah. <laughs> yeah, like it's <laughs> it's Oh, I wouldn't be surprised. It's just it's just sitting somewhere close. I just don't know where it is. But like it's over here by the door. Like it's on this little area somewhere. Maybe if I, like, stand here? No? Yeah, it's definitely that hallway. But if I'm able to walk on top of this... That is over this walkway... Then using gamer logic, my gamer brain... Then that means I'm supposed to be at this elevation to find this shape. Oh my god, is it- I think I found it. <laughs> Bro. <laughs> it was literally right here the whole time! I hate this game. <laughs> I was looking at the door. <laughs> I should have been looking at the roof of that one building. I was looking at the flag, and it was literally the other roof that didn't have the flag. No. I'm so smart. I just had to verbalize my thought process. I had to use my gamer logic words. And then the game said, "Oh, she's a real gamer. We'll let her pass. K, 
Can I enter now? Pretty please. Find the fire, Senua. To follow the path to Surt. Oh yeah, I forgot. I have to go open the gate now that I found all the runes. <laughs> I'm so good at this game. You know, this is like my third rune puzzle. I should know how this works by now. It's so pretty. Oh. oh wow, it's right there. If I can survive the fire of certain and escape my darkness, then so can you. Okay, I feel like this is gonna be a really hard one, even though it's a really short path, because Druth just gave us some wisdom. Um so I'm probably gonna enter combat pretty soon. Because it takes her forever. Just keep running, 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 just keep going, just keep going. Did I die? Told me to. Drews told me to do that. Oh my God! Wait, was I supposed to die? Bro, this game is missed the permadeath, I'm man. I'm so sorry. This darkness takes everything. Everyone. Senua. Are you sure you want to do this? We can. Is this a flashback? Together, side by side. We always do. This is my battle. I have to face it alone. Away from you. I feel like this is her husband. I don't know. You know that. Just... Just promise me... That you will come back to me. I want you to say it. I want you to say it. Do you think this is why she wants to go to Hellheim to get him? It's cause she promised. I'll come back to you. I promise. Oh my god, that eye on the bottom left is freaking me out. Come on. Oh, we're back. Oh shit, is it- Oh! Oh, it's the boss fight already? Whoa, he looks badass. You destroyed everything. Everyone. But not me. Fight me now! All the music! Okay! Oh my god. Just fighting a fire giant right now, like it's nothing. Oh my god, I'm like, I get out of the way! Dead bodies! Yeah. 
Get up! Uh oh, I didn't mean to use my focus already. Oh my god. Get up! I can! It's not charged! Oh my god, wow. These boss fights are awesome. I'm probably gonna die though. Oh fuck, fuck, they, that's right, they said don't touch him, they said don't touch him. You guys said don't touch him! <laughs> Voices! What am I supposed to do? Oh my god, why, where'd my focus go? It should be charged! Oh wait, I have to- Don't be dead, don't be dead. No, go back, Senua! What the fuck are you doing? No, oh my god, I hate that shift is just to dash towards him instead of to just run. Oh my god, we did it! Let's go, Saniwa! Let's fucking go! Sir is dead. No more God of Fire. I loved the combat music, that was sick. His level was way easier than Val Raven's. The fuck? Most of it was just puzzles. And then, like, he was an easier boss than Val Raven. A greater battle takes its place. And so it goes. Until we fall. And in the end, we all fall. Even the gods have their time. Yet we still go on. Why? I made a promise. And I will go to hell to keep I die free. Knowing you will carry my stories with you. I have fulfilled my quest. Yes, you have. When the darkness comes, I vow to guide you in this Aww. life and the next to fulfill yours. Truth is such a good being. Be ready to face horror in the eye as I have to find your answers. Your quest. Your truth. Extinguished achievement unlocks. Let's go. I that was really weird. Um, I didn't even realize that was the boss fight level coming up. Cause with Val Raven's level was way longer than this one. Val Raven's level took me longer than this one did. Truth was a troubled man. Scholar turned slave. They tortured him. Took him with them on their raids. Drove him to madness. Spreading this new form of darkness to new worlds. Wait, it has to be this way. To my world.
So is that Senua's inner voice? Wait, where's the door? Like, we had to go around because there was another door. That, I really like the music in that fight. That was really fun. The boss fights are really fun. He was an easier boss than Valraven, though, to me. Because he had more of the, like, kind of traditional boss fight stages and, like, techniques. So it was easier to read when, like, what each ability did and, like, how long it was gonna last. Oh yeah, this is where we couldn't pass through. Senua saw a deep connection form between the Northmen and the darkness. If his tales of hell were true, then that was the source of it. She learned everything she could from him, until she too could see what he saw. I really like that you walk all the way back. I like that so much. Because it makes it feel like a real place. I, I really, really like that they make you walk all the way back through the level to get... Like, they format it so that after you feed the boss, the door is close to the exit. But I really like that you walk all the way back. Like adds more depth to the world, I think, than if they just like teleported you back to the front of the Helheim gate. Have you ever died before? It's a serious question. An illusion of self. This was where the first puzzle was. You simply ceased. It was one of these crosses, Corey. Here, I'll show you. So the first one was those two beams together, but like you had to stand up there to see it. And then this one, this this was the one that had the audio thing. I'll wait for her to stop talking. And nothing is the same ever again. Senua has died before. And she will do so again. You can be sure of that. So it was, it, this was the one with the audio one, and it had like the bodies, and then this one had the screams, so it was like, oh, it's this thing. And it was like a Y with a f stick in the middle, and I was like, hmm, let me back up. And then I was like, maybe I have to go like over here. And then there was this pole that just happened to line up, and I was like, oh, it's gonna be that type of level. And then this was the only puzzle. Like, this is right when you come in. Like, the, the entrance is over there. This was the first puzzle. This is the one that had the auditory things. So none of the other ones did. It's just really weird to me. Why they didn't just make them all the same. Yeah. Like, I don't know if they originally had them as auditory driven and then they forgot to change the first puzzle. Or what? Like, I don't know what they did there. Because, like with Valraven, all of the puzzles had the same fundamentals, but they had different twists. Yeah, like that's what I mean why I was like really weirded out. And the mark of certain, you may cross the bridge over the River of Knives to Helheim. Okay, so we are missing. We did all the ones for Cert. We're missing two from Valraven's level. Um. I still have about 30 minutes. Do we want to go back and find those? Actually, wait. Are those Valravens? Yeah. Those are Valravens runes. Okay, I kind of want to go back. So it's an F and an S. Okay. I don't even know what this would be. Why did it save? This god is dead. There shouldn't be any monsters around. Okay, I think I've already looked at this one. Yeah, I looked at this one. So it's HM... Well, these two are towards the end of it. Okay. I want to get 100% because I want to know what happens if I get all the roots. And we still have like 30 minutes left before I have to end stream. 
so we have some time to find the runes. Because I don't want to enter Helheim this stream just because I don't know if it's going to throw us into like another level immediately or a huge cutscene. Like I don't want us to um, get to a point where we kind of no return and then it's like, oh, I kind of have to cut us in the middle of an adventure real quick. So that there'd be a little bit of downtime. Hi, Jib Jib! <laughs> You're actually coming in towards like the last 20 minutes of stream. I have to get off a little early tonight for, uh, because it's Love Island night with my roomies. You nap through stream again? No worries. You'll have access to the VODs. Also, I was thinking for like the holiday month in December with all the holidays, we could do like a. Uh, I could make it so that like no one needs to sub to like view old content because I don't think I'll have my computer because I'm going to be visiting family and I don't know if I'm going to lug it all the way down just for like a month so I was thinking that for that month it could just be holidays and then everyone can watch all the old streams that's what I'm thinking like my gift to you guys yellow I finally de found the puzzles and defeated the guy. <laughs> it took me forever to solve those puzzles. I saw that fire part and I was like, oh, Curry's gonna die. I almost died. <laughs> I'm trying to find runes right now. Because I, if you find all, there's like some in every level. And yeah. so I'm going into an old level right now to try and find the ones I've missed. Because they're really subtle. Maybe like, points? Well, not really points, but like just to make sure I 100% everything. Oh, oh, that's pretty. I'm just trying to remember where it is. I just had some. Ooh, I might do some peanut butter toast too. It sounds really good. Dave's bread is the best bread. Dave's killer bread is the best bread. Right. Not sponsored, but it's <laughs> really sponsored. good. Their bagels are really good too. I need to try their bagels next. See, if they're expensive, but they're so good. Because they're so thick and fluffy. And you actually eat it. That's the big thing. Like, if you get the cheap stuff and you You would like it, to like ban looking eat. left? Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> I'll just do this. I'll strafe. Just only look right. <laughs> do they glow? Like, how are you supposed to find them? They're like little parts on the map that are usually either on runestones or they're um, like little white circles uh. and when I was busy finding the puzzles to like beat this first level I missed two of them and they're towards the end make sure there's none in here you can spin right all you want but not left I bet also thank you for putting it in chat because I still haven't gotten my redemption alert thing to work did we already look at this one? We did. Okay. So there's one more and then the two we're missing. I'm just kind of following the path we took to get to the boss. Holy no Yeah. And then after I do this, I'll be ready for Low Island. Cool. I think... No worries. I, if it I mean, if, if everyone's still down, I'm down. Cause, I mean, I'm still down. Yeah. Because I like our Love Island Wednesday night stuff. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's like little... They're... Also, it's like blurry right now because we're in the Forest of Illusion, so oh, stuff's oh, like... So that's right. oh, yeah. That's spin, spin, spin. It's a circle or a rune stone with a circle in the middle. Like it but it's always a white circle. But it's very small, so it's hard to tell where stuff is. I'm gonna double we ch we found the rune in this area. I remember that. So I'm pretty sure the runes are up here somewhere. If you were battling a boss up here. Yeah, like this up here was where the boss was. 
That's my guess, is this in a corner. Right here? Yep. Oh, it's a pillar. Yeah, it's a pillar. Isn't it pretty though? It's like so pretty. They do like the Norse this is like set in Norway mm -hmm. during Viking times. I'm trying to see if there's any rune. Is it here? I th I think I got the rune in here. Oh wait, is that it right there? Oh, that could be a rune. Oh wait, that's not. <laughs> oh, it looks like a rune. It does look like one, but it's not. It's a fake one. Fake out. Um. It's just a light stone. Yeah. <laughs> They're just tricking on me. Speak to me, Drew. Tell me a story. Senua, listen. I will tell you the tale of a man called Findon. That the was him. Captured Findon's sister, and his father sent him to pay for her release. But they took his gold, put him in chains, and held him for a day and a night without food or water. Then they released him. I feel like if there isn't one in there, Upon his return, his father's enemies like, oh, here... set fire to his home. Wait. His father burnt to death. Yeah, this is his the killed. next area. But he escaped with sorrow in his heart. His father's enemies offered redress for his loss and invited him Oh wait, to no it's not. Yeah, it's this way. <laughs> it all looks so different now that like the light sun's out because we defeated the god. You know, not trying to be murdered. Who enslaved him. Nice. Yeah. And took him to hell. <laughs> Six years later, his slave masters landed on the shores of Orkney, burning all before them. I love Drew's lore. And into that fire, Findon made his escape. Alright, I'm gonna start looking left now because it's been what a few was minutes. Findon burnt away that day. Wait, wasn't but I already here? From the flames, a new man stepped I was forward, already here. Wait a minute. And Drew was born. Oh, no, this is it. You went the right way. Drew. Yeah. Yeah. The man that yeah. I am now. That's correct. Yeah, 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 so this is the right way. And though Findon never set eyes on his dear sister again, Wait. I, Drew, have found Wait, <laughs> wait, wait, where's his, where's the boss I fight? Could have seen my home before I'm so time confused time. now. Was this the boss fight? I don't remember this being the boss fight. Wait, this was the boss fight. Because I did the puzzle and then I blacked out and then like the cutscene was going on. Did all the spinning mix you up? I think it did. I don't know where the runes are that we're missing. They are hidden very well. Then there's got to be more than one rune in this area. Because we found one in this area. Good. You planned this. I might have to look for these on my own time. So I don't think we're gonna find them. I don't think they're over here. Hello. Why can't I cross? Okay, well I guess I'm not allowed to cross. The game said you already did the puzzle, you're not allowed to walk across that wooden plank anymore. I'm confused. <laughs> Why would you walk across an obviously dangerous wooden plank? It's a bridge. It's a bridge. Is this where we came in? I can't tell. Oh, I also can't jump down from here. Boo. Put your life in jeopardy. <laughs> it's a bridge. It's just a tiny bridge. Because that back there's one of the runes. It's like, it's like over there in that corner. And I'm pretty sure that's the last rune. It's like in here was the rune that we found. Right there. So it's like one of these little 
stones. Yeah, so it was this one, and then there's two more in the level. So there's one in this area. And that means there's two more, but the next area is the boss. But they're in order, which means that there's gotta be more than one here, right? could be in the last place you look, because once you find them, you won't look for them anymore. True. There, pro there might be more than one in this level. I think it might be... Because to find the last rune, you had to go over there. So maybe there's one over there. Is there one over here in the corner? No. Make sure. We had to go like up here, I think. Not the crow still being alive. Oh, if there's any more over here. Because you had to stand here to get the last one. So maybe there's one in this area of the map. I just don't know where the last one would be if there is one here. I think the reason I can't walk across these anymore is because the, the illusion gates are, are closed and so that part of collision isn't working. Tour goal is to 100%. I want 100% it. But if I can't find these two runes, we're not going to be able to. Because I want to know what happens if you fill them all up. Yeah, my goal is to 100% it. Because I want to know what happens if you find all the runes. That's gotta be the only rune stone in this area. Because this took me forever to finish this area and I didn't see any more. Which means there's gotta be one hidden in there. Little white stone. White. What if games were like, once you 100% them, they give you a coffee? Or you, you get you a code? See, I wouldn't want a full refund. Because you still want to pay the people that made it. But I would be cool if like... I guess you, you would just get- oh, is that one? Oh wait, no, that's the one that we were like, oh, is that one? And it was fake. And I don't know if I can even do these anymore because the portals are closed. I sure hope it's not somewhere that I can't get to. That would suck. Because so much of this are illusion gates. Yeah, 
Yeah, the illusions are broken. Wait. No, they're not. They're still happening. The heck? I can still get up there. I didn't think the portals would still be up if Fall Raven's dead. There's a game out right now where you 100% completed it, it gives you a private email address to the devs and you can send them whatever ask questions. That's cool. But what's to stop them from sharing that email online, whoever gets it? And then, like, you don't have to 100% the game to ask the dev stuff. They did a thing through Steam, but not sure. I mean, you would think people would have basic human decency, but not always. Oh, let's go. It does work. I can't go up here. Yeah, and then we go this way, and we have to go through the other portal. There's no rune up here. It's a niche space game, so the player crowd is pretty chill. That's good. I have no idea where these runes are. I wonder if they're hidden behind like an illusion gate or something. Well, I'll have to either look it up or find it on my own time. I don't think I'm gonna find them. Is that a fake rock? That is a fake rock. I hate that those are the same size as the actual runes. And they're so often a thing. Okay, well... Unfortunate. The forest is so pretty. Runes are. Oh yeah, this was me on the way back. Wait a minute. Could they be over here somewhere? Yeah, because you came in. Not. Yeah, and then you went down here. Okay, 
one over here. Well, back to Helheim. I'll have to look up where the last two runes are in this level and then find it off stream. Because I feel like they're in just like really niche spots. I don't want to open it yet. I'm going to open it next stream. Um, which will be... Either... I think either tomorrow or... Next Monday? Yeah. Tomorrow or Monday. Because I won't be here over the weekend, so... How are games? We defeated Surt. Um, we realized that we we're missing two runes from... Val Raven, and I really want 100% it, like two of these runes. See how we're missing two? But we got all of Surt's. Any deaths? No, but almost died during the boss fight. Like the backpacks? Yeah, we got cucked by two runes. I went back to Val Raven's level, but I can't find it, so I'm probably gonna look for it off stream. And like kind of do the wiki and be like where's the last two runes because i went through the last two areas after the third rune and i didn't see any so uh i don't know where they are but you actually came in right at the end tyler because um i had to go at nine and it's almost nine but uh, you missed it it was a fun boss fight i really liked the combat music that was really fun the level was shorter than val ravens i think even though the puzzles were more difficult. And Chalk is being a butt leaving scene. I'm sorry. It wasn't going to be a super long stream tonight anyway. Because it is a school night. But after next weekend. I will be able to do weekend streams. Where I can stream it earlier. And stream a little longer. So. Because there won't be any class. So I would just be working around my work schedule. So weekend streams would be. Kind of variable. School is for nerds. <laughs> I need school so I can make the good monies, though. <sighs> but yeah, but we opened- we have the seal broken. I just don't want to go in yet because I know it's going to um, send us on our next part of the adventure. And with stream about to end, I don't want to like throw us down that rabbit hole yet. Slinging pills makes good money without school. Oh boy. Yeah, I was about to say, that's dangerous. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry stream is a little short tonight. Um, but after this weekend, we'll be able to stream more frequently. So that'll be good. Because I would like to finish this game before October. I don't know how long this game is, but we're a good decent way through it, I think. We're like 20% through it. So, because this assignment is due October 7th. So if we finish the game by then, we'll be good. Worst case, I'll just do like a really long weekend stream and just do it all day or something. I don't know if I just need to grind out the game. Do you have any special stream ideas for Spooptober? I was actually thinking about that. Wait, assignment? Yeah, I'm actually playing Hellblade as part of one of my uh, games and culture classes. Our professor uh, has us choose from a list of games and I wanted to pick one I'd never heard of, which was Hellblade, and I actually really liked the game, it turns out. Um, 
and just kind of like share your experience playing it and stuff like that. So, and let's do the seventh to have our playthrough done. And I was like, Hellblade seems pretty cool. I'll stream it with you guys, and you guys can join me on this adventure of playing a game none of us have seen before. I am streaming my homework, you're right. <laughs> it's big, big kudos. Very lucky to be able to do it, I will say. He had some good games on there too, like What Remains of Edith Finch was an option, Life is Strange was an option, but I was like, I know nothing about Hellblade, never seen it before. And I'm really glad that I picked it. It's a fun adventure. Did you have to buy it? Yes. But the textbooks for the class you can get online through the library for free, so it balances out the cost for the class, roughly. Yeah. Yeah, I bought it in addition to course fees. Yeah. I didn't have to buy the textbooks, though. So the only mon the only money I'm spending on his class is to buy games for the projects. So I kind of in my head I kind of factor it as if I am buying the textbooks and like this game is just a textbook, you know? Cuz it's a pretty cheap textbook if it's only $30. That's true. For some of them you do though. For like um like the foreign language ones at least at my school, all the foreign language classes, you need the online code that you get from the brand new book so that you can use the, uh, the website and do the activities and stuff on there, and then the teachers grade that. If the teachers actually grade them. Yeah. Mines do. Or mine did. Mine didn't. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I like some of the foreign languages. They be built different. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know what I want to do for Spooktober. I'm thinking of doing um, a horror game, but I don't know what I want to do. I think... Actually, let me see. There's... Um, the people that made Little Hope are coming out with another game, and I think it comes out this winter. Dark Pictures, yeah. House of Ashes is the next one. When does this one come out? Oh! It comes out, um... October 22nd. So there's one we can play. It's like, um... Have you seen Until Dawn? It's by the people who made that. And who made Little Hope, which I have also streamed before. I streamed that last year. Um... They're coming out with another one this October called House of Ashes, which I'm definitely going to be playing because it is really fun to play those games. So that's one game we'll be doing this on October for Spooktober, but it'll be towards the end of the month, so it'll be closer to Halloween. Um, it's basically like a it's um, a choose your own adventure, but horror edition. So you basically play as these different characters. And your choices affect whether they live or die, if they escape certain situations, stuff like that. Um, definitely recommend watching Until Dawn. It's a good... Uh, it was a great debut for this team. Because it was... It's kind of like Cabin in the Woods, if you've ever seen that horror movie. Where it kind of plays off the cliches and kind of pokes fun at them. And so it's really entertaining. Um, I would recommend if you watch... Look, a lot of big... YouTube creators have played Until Dawn because it's been out for a long time. Um, it is older, so like the character motion capture and stuff doesn't hold up as well as the newer games do, but they're roughly around the same quality. So I, I go back and watch Until Dawn Let's Play a lot. I am also a scaredy cat. Uh, if you go to... I don't have it uploaded on Twitch, but if you go to my YouTube channel... Which I think is still linked to my Twitch. If not, I can send the link of it real quick. Um, it it um has the whole little hope. Let's play. Let me pull it up. And little nightmares because these were streamed a long time ago. 
Um, yeah, I did Little Hope in two. Yeah, I'll put the playlist in chat for you guys. Um, I've also considered uploading the videos to my VODs on Twitch. Because at the time, I didn't have VODs enabled because I didn't know how. Or I had VODs enabled. I didn't have... I didn't understand how highlights worked. And I didn't realize that you could use highlights to basically save full streams. Um, Little Nightmares is that off angle puzzle horror game. It's like a platformer, I would say. It's a fun game, though. But yeah, that YouTube channel is where I used to put like some of my long VODs of like Little Nightmares, Little Hope, those type of games. Um, I don't use it anymore now that I've figured out how to save VODs on Twitch better, so they don't expire. Um, but yeah. Definitely, you can see Little Hope for the vibe. But uh, House of Ashes is the next one, and it kind of gives me like Uncharted vibes. Like the settings, very like treasure hunters type of stuff. But like they're going against like cursed uh, demons or something. Yeah, it it the camera is very uh, off angle, but it's it's still like playable. Like I didn't I didn't notice it being very. Um, distracting as you played it but if you watch it for the first time it is kind of off-putting because it, it doesn't look like a normal side scroller but it's a good game I haven't played the second one yet because the second one came out in like January but I'll play it when my next paycheck comes in <laughs> I also need to save money for uh... yeah we could do that we could do House of Ashes we could do maybe some Phasmophobia with friends that'd be fun I haven't played Phasmophobia in a while. I was thinking of doing like spooky games like that for Spooptober. And then we can also like break that up with like Valorant and like or like shooters or like multiplayer games like that too. Phasmo got so hard. Yeah, I heard there was like an update and it changed the whole game. Like I have friends that play Phasmo like a lot and after the update came out, they said that it felt like they were new with the game again. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm just ending stream real quick. Yeah. But yeah, no, it's crazy how much that game's changed. All right, I am going to hop off for the night because it's Love Island time. But I will see you all. Either. Yeah, I'll see you guys all next week, because there's tomorrow I have a lot of work to do. Yeah. Good night. I will see you guys next week, and starting next week we'll have more, more streams more often. I promise. Have a good night, everyone. Bye-bye.